Hey guys, it's ZB GamerX, and welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Gold Tag Lock series with Tim. Or if this is your first time watching this series ever, then welcome to the Pokemon Gold Tag Lock series with Tim. <laughs> but, but basically, what this is, is that we're both doing a playthrough of gold, where we alternate the save files between gyms. So I'm going to take on the second gym, while it's my turn, and then after I beat that gym, the game is the game's gonna go over to 10, so he'll do the third gym, and etc, etc. And another thing about these Pokemon in this game, is that we put it through the randomizer, so that all the moves have been updated to like the regular base powers, so... Alright, um, right, let's look at Cyndaquil for a second. Oh, wait, what's up? Oh, hang on. <laughs> Emily went too fast, um... Alright, so right there we have Tackle. Normally it's supposed to be like 35 base power in this generation. It's actually going to be 50 base power because that's what the base power of tackle is. Now, that's what the base power of tackle is now in the you know more recent generation. So I'm gonna, and also all the Pokemon stats have been randomized. So if you look at the stack, so Rocky the Onyx. Yeah, 39 attack got a level 10 Onyx is not normal. So. <coughs> Yeah, the stats are randomized. I don't know if they're like if they all still equal to so that the base stat totals are the same. I have no clue if that's the case, but yeah, so yeah. Um losing my train of thought right here. And also we haven't really found this found this out yet, but I believe if the Pokemon evolve their stat will be randomized again, so right here we have Tower of the Centret, so it detects as 16, which is in its speed is 16, so it could be the same, but when it evolves, its high side could be special attack, so yeah, that would be pretty bad. But I will go over the team quickly. Very Rocky the Onyx. Tower of the Centret. Statue the Buttercream. And it's stats are okay, I guess. ET the unknown. The only reason we have it is because it's hidden power ice, which is very useful against the first gym. And Cyndaquil, the Cyndaquil. Because <laughs> we got to give it a nickname. Has to Ember soon. But its special attack that is really good. Which is exactly what you want on a Cyndaquil. And hopefully we can keep that type of attack potion. And then we have ET the Spear, who has really high attack stats. Because based on my crystal nose lock, the tank and speed were almost identical, so... Yeah, Alright, that's pretty much it for going over the team. I also have to point out that this awesome layer has been made by Lola, also known as Lightning Dragonite. Make sure to check her out. She makes awesome Pokemon content. I'll leave a link to her channel in the description. Oh yeah, and before we go any further, since we just beat the gym, I have to talk to Professor Elm's assistant in order to give us this like for this Pokemon link, and of course, I have to go to positive Pokemon in order to, in order to bring out the team and put in the PC. I also we changed the text chat so that it moves really fast. Right, so we're going to depart, I'm going to deposit the egg for now. I don't know what Tim's idea is about bringing the egg onto the team, but I'll leave that up to him because I'm probably not going to use a Toby because that's what I have to do next. Alright, we're going to send Rocky up front, but as we continue through the next few routes, and of course the yeah, emulator moves so fast. Wait, wait, where am I going? Which way? Wait, I probably went the long way around. And of course we already went through the ruins as well. Because that's where we got the unknown. I have no idea why I took the long way around. Actually, there is a barrier right here, so let's get this. Paralyzed through a that's nice. And of course, this is not a Nuzlocke, so I could have just been able to if I wanted to. I believe. That might actually be useful. I'm not sure, because Anaphos is one of my favorite Pokemon ever. I'm going to send out a weaker Pokemon to see what it can do. Yeah, I'm going to check out these moves real quick. Um, 
Yeah, let's try... I'm gonna try something called Tackle. Let's see what I can actually do. Yeah, so far it's not too promising. And of course, this is the Growl. And now I'll just knock it out. Okay, Air Force is one of my favorite Pokemon, but you can see that much potential because there's an only no two moves. So you do the tackle, fulfill one shot to the cat, and yes it will with a critical hit. And of course this rock this onyx was the thing to retreat, so it of course the big boost experience. The tackle is not enough to knock out the do that, so I guess the thing is really high defense. That leads like oh critical hit, that's why I did so much. And Rocky's leveled up. Still did not learn Rock though. Actually, I think he just, like, just learned fine. Right? So, who about fun? I guess we'll send Cinderella up front then. It needs to learn Emma really badly. Alright, let's have a her. If I can remember correctly from the Crystal Nose last show, he's made a man yet. Alright, so, unfortunately, Cinderella's attack stat is really bad. Looks like they're gonna have a better attack stat, so. And. Cyndaquil got a bit damage there, but again, it's not no block, so it basically doesn't matter. And I'll just ignore the Marie for now. Oh shit, that's nice. Another Marie. A Rotata. I can't remember what this thing was like. Oh, I didn't even pay attention on my damage today, so again, I was like, too fast, damn it. A hop it. The only reason I don't like hop it is because it only has flash and synthesis around this level. Let's see what stats are like. Okay, um and no skill works, so yeah, I'm not doing with it. Another Rotana, for an I don't think any of these water type Pokemon come in water type moves yet, but except for Polywag. Alright, so I can still send Etika out. Yep, bubble. I think it's pretty bad power in this generation. Yeah, Peck didn't do that much. I guess Power is really expensive, or... Well, then again, it's only two levels lower. And yeah, Power again, so... Peck. Another Peck. If Gnosis should have said it failed, it failed. Should have admit, that doesn't affect. So yeah, each guy got got quite a bit of damage for that battle. I don't think I think he had like magic cards or gold or something. Magical. Alright, so oh wow, that tackle's not doing anything. I guess that I guess magic card is really high defense. Of course all they can do is splash around. Of course if one's level 15, how much damage is that gonna do? Wow, that actually gets it like uh, actually, I'm not, that's not just there. Whoa, wait. Tackle not doing any damage. Wow, that's pathetic. Um. Uh, who should I send out? Let's send a set here. And whenever I catch Pokemon, I'm probably not going to make any Wow, that confusion did a lot. So I guess the Petra Carpet is like really bad special defense. Put you out for Cinderfell. And then hope you'll level up with Ember. Come on. Ember? Oh, really? I guess it was like level 13 on Ember. If I can ever. Oh, crap, I didn't. Wake up Cinderfell, try it. Alright, um. Can I send this actually because it's probably not attack? I guess she hard. Oh, great, Super Sonic. And you hurt yourself. Come on, oh, hurt yourself again. Okay, wait, okay, that's fair. Super Sonic again. Uh oh. Oh god, that creature did so much. Um. I guess it's not a Rocky. I need a tackle. Ignore order. Mm. Man. That's right, Rocky's such a past level 10. Not gonna listen to me anymore. Oh, come on! There you go. I got the tackle. I should think there's a Pokemon Center coming up ahead, so... Maybe if I could sneak around this one thing, I can go ahead and heal up. 
we got to do it from past in. Now we have this chase of stuff for kill. Dude, just right now, it's just for one million dollars. Of course I'll take it. Okay. I believe you give me the old rod, don't you? There you go, we got the old rod. Alright, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to register that item. Try to find it, try to select. Oops, okay, anyway, wait, you guys know, of course, I didn't switch us in the call again. No, 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 I'm an idiot. Alright, um. Let's go, you come out. Tackle didn't do that much. That pack did a lot though. Alright, another pack. Keep pecking. And a spear, okay. This thing doesn't have great defense, so maybe it'll be a one shot? No, oh, critical hit, really? Alright, let's get leveled up. Alright, so now I guess I will go up first. Alright, um, now let's battle this train right here. Looper. I'm not gonna lie, Fire Side is one of my favorite Fire Side Pokemon of all time. Especially in this generation, it probably is my favorite. Oh wow, that tackle did a lot, so I guess this thing is my great defense. Because normally this thing does have great defense. It's just only a killer, and I don't really see that much potential for it. Let's head back into the grass and find another Rattata. Let's power you. There's an iron back there. I think that's a great ball. Alright, regular Nidor in. Oh, horn attack. Decent damage. Tackle. Wow, you need to do half. Here we got the tackle. Almost leveled up. Let's get this item. I think, I think you can level up there, can you? Ooh, quick attack, that's nice. But I think Tackle is stronger in this generation, and I guess that's she's the only one that's blow up. Alright, baseball, that's nice. Is there any more trainers up ahead? Alright, Bell's Pile. I think it's more shot with confusion. And Rattata, let me that. Okay, that was the only trainer. Alright, so now. There you go, it's time to head in. To... Well, I forgot what's sitting in this cave was. Is it Union Cave? I think it was called Union Cave. Ooh, it really not tell me. Got the item. Oh! Okay. Onyx. Oh! Okay. But I can't learn Lock Grove yet, so... I guess I can use Confusion. and speed advantage. Tackle. Okay, for the second one. Alright. Oh wow, that didn't do anything. Um, fine. Okay, sorry, can't do it Okay, it's kind of into a glitch, and hopefully the sound files did not get fucked up. Because the recording software I use tends to do that sometimes. If you happens to freeze for a second, the sound file just kind of get messed up a bit. So, hopefully, I can remember to fix that. Um, well, I don't know it's now a little long, so I could probably just switch out. Oh, come on. I'm gonna switch out Sand G for Edgy. That's gonna probably be really helpful in here. Alright, so Geo Dude, so I'm probably gonna ignore that. So, you have Geo Dude, so it's gonna be more experienced. Get Power Ice. Yep, do 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 it down. Another hit power. And another hit power. But then Steve ends that time. Wow, that actually survived. And it goes just down, so. You have a coughing if I can remember correctly. I don't know. Um, I guess I'll still send this actually for this fight. Yep, he just had popping, so... Fusion? Will be not to one shot? Yes, it will be. And then 
the coffee when I make the fusion. And I believe there's an item down here. Is it another great ball? Yes it is. Um now just keep Satchi up front for a little while. Oh nice! Alright. I could catch it so that um so that Rocket Life will be ordered, but I don't think it's worth it. Not to mention it's a pretty little type rate if I can remember correctly. X attack? I'm gonna sell that. Ooh, it's sand troop. The Pokemon has been really helpful in my crystal nose lock. Of course the stats are randomized, so who knows what this thing has. Okay, scratch how much will that do? Decent amount. Four games on a level 11 Pokemon. What's your defense like? 17? Um. You don't think I might catch you? Yeah, and I, one thing I mean, I'm trying to do is that we use too much of my team that is used to my crystal nose lock. We got the same shoe. Oh no, I'm not gonna give nicknames to any po any Pokemon, so you will never probably catch them. Doesn't similar give Pokemon nicknames and I have no creativity. Nor do I know that many Japanese names. Right, so um he has a slow book, so I'll switch that that be out for I guess Itsuka. Oh, you? Alright, so let's do the tech. Alright. Oh, whoa! So I after the speed advantage! And wow, it's really 10 damage! Oh, crap, we nice timing. Now I'm tempted to catch a slowpoke! I think, yeah, just get some easy experience there. I believe the TM for Swift is down here as well, and we are not taking that on. And then of course it's another ice. TM39, I believe that is Swift. And we can learn... <laughs> A lot of Pokemon can actually learn Swift. I'm pretty sure Type Lotion can learn Swift by leveling up. Well, I know for sure it can in the third generation. I'm not sure about this generation. Itsuka doesn't run that many good normal type moves. I know, I'm gonna hold on to Swift for now. And of course, another Onyx. Let's get the item, which is an X Defend. Use this item, as usual. Alright, we can. Use the pack. Get this last item, which is an awakening. Another Judo. Well, I couldn't escape. I get Judo to have you have high speed then. All right. Um. You have a whole fix if I remember correctly. So I guess I could keep these to get out front for now. You have a whole fix. Quick attack. Eh, it didn't do that much. Another quick attack. So I'm not seeing that many good things for Volpec. Alright, so we can go level up. I guess I'll send Edgy back up front since the other part is still leveling up, if I can remember correctly. Look at the Fury, look at the point of your Fury. This person's been talking to knock down my hoo hoos in my crystal nose lock series. This is really the only death I had in that series so far. Lock throw. Oh god, critical hit. Hit power, wow, I didn't do anything. Alright, tackle, lucky survive. Just a little bit of power. And she leveled up. And now I'm the top. I guess I had she. Alright, fusion. Lucky says fusion. And... He 
second damage. Go kick. Yep. <laughs> Didn't do anything. And it's actually will level up. And yeah, for your vibe in this area time. Alright, so let's go to PC and let's check on Sanctuary. What are your cats like? 68 points attack stat and 15 speed. Oh, your stat's actually pretty good. Considering your type weakness, since you're only weak to water, grass, and ice, having high special defense is really helpful. That's all those moves are special back then. And having a 16 attack stat is really good. I think I might bring Sandshrew onto the team. But the question is, who would I replace it with? If I replace it with Chikaru, I guess, then... It's clear that Sarasaurus' attack and speed are going to be higher than Chikaru by the time it gets to level 11. And she might be helpful for the next gym. As long as it doesn't get hit with Fury Card. Because uh, it will help take out the fight there. <coughs> yeah, excuse me. That was even bothering me all day. Yeah, so I guess I'll put Chiharo in the PC since you're not going to be that useful for right now. Alright, so now I'm in. Now I'm kind of bring it up. I'm going to heal up. And I guess that's going to do it for this episode. So for the next episode, we're going to go through Slowpoke Well, Battle Rival Silver, and then take on the next gym. So, as of right now, it looks like our time is up. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Don't forget to check out my other videos, and don't forget to check out Tim and Lola's channel as well. And I will see you guys next time.